Hello everybody and welcome back. I'm Stranky and we have lots of money here. It's not really real money, but it's money. Anyway, so um yeah, monthly update and as usual I'll be um messing with the old um thingamajig while we're doing it. Now we can get a lot of angels, so let's claim we will reset and we start from scratch. But it's okay, we can do some of this. Anyway, so um yeah, I didn't um, do one for the month of April. I actually did record one. I just never put it up because I got sick and about 50% of what I said in it would be invalid because of getting sick. So, um, yeah, unfortunately... Um, I had to sort of make the decision not to put the video up. Um, that being said, it's okay because um, I kind of got on with the month anyway and um, pretty much managed to get as many videos as I could up. I mean, at least I had a bit of a backlog when I was sick and I've been sick again if you um, can hear here and there's been a couple of days with, with no videos but uh, again I had a bit of a backlog it's just a matter of sitting down and uh, rendering them and getting them up uh, up live so um, yeah but I thought let me do an update this month because obviously uh, two months with no update is not very good so um, we'll start off from the main things which would obviously always be prison architect um, there's been another update um, today is the 2nd of May so um, I think we received the email on Friday I believe ish something day I'm not sure I can't I swear to you what day it was but yeah there, there was the update and um, there's now the weather, weather, the weather system in it um, with flooding and stuff so the next couple of episodes I haven't recorded them yet but hopefully because um, I don't really have any backlogs to go up anymore um, hopefully I'll manage to sit down, uh, clear my nose and my throat enough to do at least a couple of episodes so uh, we'll try out the weather while we obviously still um, implement the heating and uh, build our maximum sec bit but yeah I mean it's still more to go on prison architect till we wrap up at least this prison and then we'll see what we're gonna do after that if we'll continue with prison architect or we'll go back to theme hospital and we'll, we'll have to see because um, they're saying they're going to keep supporting it but I don't know for how long they'll support it and uh, how many more up updates will come out having said that I mean because this prison we've done has pretty much um, I think it was since update 2 when the females came out so it's pretty much spanned about 5 months ish um, well obviously not because we had sold a prism but the idea of the females um, so I mean we've got at least three updates in it which has made it a little bit disjointed so maybe we could sort of learn from what we've done and uh, if there's no more updates as far as um, features coming out it might more be performance or bugs or whatnot we can uh, just sort of design a prison um, and not have to um, worry about the updates and we take it a bit slowly something like that we'll have to see um, as for um, hire all these guys and we can get the easy upgrader uh, that's only 10, that's 100 how many do we have? 300,000 I don't want to use them all up because they give you more money um, yeah but I was saying something and it's completely like just from my mind um, 
but yeah so I mean prison architect obviously yeah we started off the channel with it so it's always gonna hold um, hold something to us even if we take a short break from it we'll probably go back to it and um, and uh, do something else with it obviously if you like to uh, to see more please uh, like and comment on the videos because obviously I say okay people are liking prison architect I'll do more prison architect stuff so um, yeah it will help you and help me and generally everyone will be much better just by a little clicky clicky of a like on the prison architect video or leave a comment um, I'm still waiting for votes on the little area we have so yep yeah, and I've been going on too long on prison architect so that's prison architect um, KSP is pretty much um, wrapping up I'm trying to finish off all the missions um, a bit different I mean I'm, I'm my original plan for the series was to have multiple missions going at once kind of like NASA would do and have it as in real time uh, as much in real time as possible but it's just not possible to keep track of everything and um, yeah that's why there's the the time warping feature so yeah with the version 1.1 launch I'm gonna see if we can continue with the same save game if we can we'll continue with the same one continue to try and bring Valentina home and we will continue um, I forgot what I was gonna say we'll continue the missions we have and um, obviously Barrett and Jeremiah will um, try and go further into the depths of space and um, more or less get what they can get so um, well, uh, we'll. If it doesn't, then we'll have to start from scratch, and obviously use what we've learned. I think we're getting a bit better now, hopefully. Um, well, we'll see if I can continue the game. We'll continue the same game. So um, I don't really see why it shouldn't. There's just a few more uh, bits and pieces and performance updates and stuff like that. But because it's a whole new engine, it might just. Um, freak out and it might not work I'll have to see I, I have yet to uh, update the actual where the save game is um, I should have a different install of Kerbal so um, where, where I'm playing the game so it doesn't update um, on the fly anyway um, so that's something I've got to try out and um, until I've finished off what I can I think I'm pretty much there, but we'll see. Um, that's Kerbal, then obviously Minecraft. As much daily as possible it will be, um, if that makes any sense. It will be as daily as possible. Um, obviously we're doing the tower and stuff, so yeah, having a lot of fun with that. It's a bit more relaxing some, than some of the other games. And um, again, if you have any ideas, any goals you would like to to suggest for me to do leave them in the comments and you can leave them in this video you can leave them in the random minecraft video it's fine um, and if you like the series don't forget to hit like it's seeming to be picking up ground and I actually seem to be getting more subscribers from it than from other videos so um, that's quite Adi, good I see. Adi, I see. hello mate I see I see. And, um. <coughs> oh, that's nice to cough. Oh, I'll be back in a second. Okay, I'm back. Um, as you could hear, I'm not the only um, ill person in the house. So, uh, yeah, there's a lot of dready lur dreaded lurgy going around. Um, but I think I'm the one who made everyone sick. So, anyway, um, but, yep, yeah, so Minecraft should still be going on for the time being and we'll see how we go I mean I might end up with a really long series with it might get burnt out after a little while I don't know um, I'm still enjoying it for now so um, yeah 
we'll continue as we are with Minecraft. Um, then we have obviously um, Don't Starve is ended for now although um, its replacement which was supposed to be the long dark was fine in testing and then when I actually got to do a proper recording it was very very jumpy. I did put up the um, the two videos that I recorded of it because I thought I wasn't I wasn't happy with the quality but I thought in case I continue because where I started off was very good at least they're there if someone wants to see how it got started um, so I might relook into Don't Star for another another run at it um, it's a fun game but it's um, it's a bit stressful for me. I don't really like the the. I I kind of like the games where you have to just like you sit down and you chill, and um, take a load off because my job is quite stressful. So to actually play a game like that, it's a bit stressful. I mean, like Minecraft can be, but you can sort of play it at your own pace, as with Prison Architect, um, and sort of to a certain extent, as with Kerbal Space Program. So actually to make sure you have to get food by a certain time because you're going to starve it is a bit stressful but anyway um, it's okay um, we, we will manage anyway but yeah if um, if I manage I will obviously continue the long dark um, it will it will continue. I don't just I can't tell you exactly when. Hopefully, sometime this month it will continue. If not, I'll just focus on on those three for now. Obviously, Game Dev Tycoon. I'm still trying to get my um, my save file from the other computer. Um, I have no idea where it was saved. Um, I had the Steam version that I found the save, but that wasn't where it was because originally I had bought the game from I can't remember the name of the publisher's Green Heart Gaming is it um, so I bought it directly from them and then later on they sent me the Steam key which then I joined to the game and um, then I ended up with two installs so where the actual save game is on the one that we were doing I have no idea but I'm trying to get it back when I get it back we'll try and finish it off or at least get to a certain point where it's good to say we'll stop hopefully I'll remember where we're at I'll probably watch the uh, six episodes that we have so that um, I can uh, jump back in in a fashionable manner at least I'll catch up with the last episode or something like that I'll, I'll probably watch watch all of them just to be safe um, obviously soul zero as well um, I was think I've spoken about this before it's gone through another couple of updates and um, probably I'll do a whole new run uh, maybe not in the Gustav crater maybe somewhere else I mean I've done a bit of a moon one once with one of these videos so um, yeah, we might do do another run Soul Zero. I like the game. It's very addictive once you get it open. It's just the when you sit down. Do I feel like doing that? No. Do I feel like doing that? No. Then when you finally open it, it's a really good game. So um, so yeah, Soul Zero still on the still on the uh, the tables to be done at some point. Um, City Skylines. Yes, it's gone gone a wall again. I know I did try to do another episode but again it's it seems that once the get the city gets to a certain size um, everything desyncs and goes all jumpy and, and funny and I wasn't too happy with the quality of the recording so um, it's something I have to really really look into um, which I'm going to discuss in a few minutes after I go through all of the games actually um, theme hospital uh, that will probably come back as and when we uh, take a break from Prison Architect again. Um, it will be coming, um, I'm just warning everyone. Obviously if um, if you would rather 
prison architect then continuing um, theme hospital uh, do let me know because um, or at least I'll play them concurrently and there'll be less episodes of each but yeah obviously there's only so much prison architect I can I can do and I'm feeling a bit burnt, burnt, burnt out that's why I'm doing all the new features and stuff but we'll see I mean I'm going back to prison architect again I've already been through it all anyway yeah we'll see um, but theme hospital is something I always like the game and it's one of my favorite all-time games so um, yeah I'd like to continue the the playthrough of that as well it's just how much time I have to do any particular thing um, is um, no, we don't want to spend angels on them um, do we have any more? look there's already counting up it makes a big difference when you get these angels um, anyway but so yeah so that's um, theme hospital and other games coming up I I mentioned it in one of the Minecraft videos this week I've been playing some Star Citizen I really like it I mean in its current states in alpha um, the alpha updates are a bit um, huge when it does them I mean it takes a good day to do the update for me but um, I really need to delve a bit deeper into the game um, I'm not very good I don't know the controls yet very well um, and for some reason I can't read anything on the screen it's all jumbled up um, I have I don't have the best video card but I have a pretty decent video card and it should um, what am I doing there and it should uh, display much better than it's displaying. It's just the menus though, the, the game itself looks fine. Again, once I start recording, I did a couple of episodes going around the hangar and whatnot. The recording just doesn't doesn't come out, no matter what I use. Um, it's a shame, because um, I'm looking forward to getting the content out for Star Citizen, and I think we could do a really good good playthrough with it and I'm doing patterns with my mouse we anyway so yeah that's Star Citizen and um, hopefully yeah, we'll, we'll get that sorted out and um, Subnautica I've had Subnautica on the list for quite some time it's never popped its head above the water um, yes Subnautica is also coming um, I can't guarantee when or how many episodes and, and whatnot but again it's fine until I hit the record button once I hit the record button I think I'm pretty much running at the limit of this computer I've tweaked it as much as possible I can record um, Prison Architect, KSP um, I can record those games can record Minecraft but once it gets a bit more um, a bit more intensive the CPU is just like this and so, dude I've only got two cores I can't handle this and it's just that that, that extra 5% that it really needs to to do it and it just it won't or, or the RAM um, so I mean I fixed a lot of the problems I had early on when I moved to this computer where it wasn't working properly and since then I've tweaked it even more for better performance um, but yeah um, it's just not quite there, I mean, as I said the, the video card is the strong part of this and um, actually for recording I've moved away from Bandicam again I've, I'm back on um, OBS if that's what it's called um, the one with the black circle I can't get it to work with Twitch though but anyway that's another thing uh, anyway um, and I'm using Bandicam for KSP because um, the OBS I can use the NVEC codec or whatever it is or whatever so it uses less CPU and more video card and I can use the strength of my video card um, it's the same as using Shadow Play really uh, Shadow play is good, but the audio is a bit, meh. and also there's 
when there's no timer, and I like to have a timer, um, otherwise I just have no idea and I'm guessing and videos go all, go all over the place. And um, the other thing is with OBS I get a preview of how it's looking, I can see how smooth it is. Like right now I can see we're going solid 30 frames a second and it dropped to 27 and back up to 30, 29, so I mean we're pretty much okay as far as recording goes. When I put it on KSP for some reason that codec doesn't work so I have to use Bandicam. Um, whereas with Shadow Play, I have no idea what it's doing. It seems to do variable for video and static for audio and then everything ends up all jumbled up and I can't edit it all together properly and uh, it's a whole big mess. So um, yeah, that's that. So um, now the two other things I want to talk about apart from the main games is the um, PlayStation 4. Um, as you may have noticed probably about three months ago now, I put up a couple of videos of Dragon Age Inquisition. Those were done on my PlayStation 4 and um, it's a bit of a, not a really, it's not a huge hassle um, but I have to plug in um, I can only do it in 15 minute chunks and I have to plug in the flash drive into the PlayStation, save the PlayStation to the flash drive which takes forever to transfer for some reason and then plug that flash drive into the computer, transfer them over and then splice them all together then edit them and it's a bit of a longer process and it was just putting me off actually turning it on and doing it. So um, you know if I have 20 minutes to waste I'd rather get out and up another episode of Minecraft Prison Architect um, rather than stay editing or copying files for another video. Um, but I think I, I can make use of it um, in another way. So I set it up with Twitch. As I said, I can't somehow connect this computer to Twitch properly. I don't know why. Just, it just says I'm not. I'm, I'm offline. Um, again, it might just be the power of the computer won't manage it, or the Wi-Fi signal. But I mean, quite near the router. But I, I don't know. Um, but the PlayStation seemed to work. I did the test, and it seemed to be working. And apart from doing the test, I saw myself from the phone, and so. Uh, I mean, I was a few minutes behind, well, not really a few minutes, but like 20 seconds behind. Um, but yeah, there, w there was the stream going on and it was working. So probably what I'm going to do, I've talked about it briefly, is I've got the uh, Dragon Age Inquisition playthrough to continue and also I have War Thunder. I do have a few other games on it, but I like the look of War Thunder, so I'll probably be trying those out on Twitch and um, then linking those videos through YouTube. Um, I, find, I found a way through Twitch to link them in YouTube so then they end up, I don't know how it'll end up being called and I might be able to edit the file names and whatnot before they go live. We'll have to see. Um, but I'll probably do a couple of tests maybe later this week. It all depends on what time I have and, and whatnot. So uh, yeah, you can look forward to that also uh, coming on the channel. And another reason for that is I might be down from the computer for a few days because hopefully later this month I'll be building the new PC. And with the new PC comes great power. And with great power comes Star Citizen and uh, the Long Dark and Subnautica. <laughs> and um, yeah, that's what, and probably City Skylines as well. So yeah. I've got all the parts, I sort of had an idea of what I wanted to do, um, so I've in fact changed my mind on the motherboard, I'm getting a bit of a better one, uh, for the reason that if I ever want to update the video card it will support a better one later on, um, but yeah I mean it's not going to be like massively um, piss yourself good um, 
just drop something, sorry. Uh, but it's going to be head and shoulders better than this one. So, um, yeah, and how I'm sort of planning it out is so that I can further upgrade it later on to be even better. But, I mean, we should be able to get much, much more out of it. Obviously, I have to see how it behaves. Um, but um, I don't see why we can't start doing more uh, than we're doing right now. So, um, yeah, I mean, the computer is a bit of a, a problem for me. Uh, I'm doing my best to uh, to get through it. As you know, I had some problems earlier with tires blowing out and whatnot. But um, yeah, finally I've got pretty much the budget aside and I can build it up. So um, yeah, hopefully later this month, maybe early next month, we will be on a new machine. So there might be a lot of PlayStation stuff coming while it's in transition. But we'll see. I might keep this one for the rendering and the other one for the recording and we'll see how I do that um, but it should be okay so anyway that's enough I've been going on for a good 20 odd minutes most people do their updates in 7 I don't know how they do it I tend to ramble much more um, but anyway thanks for watching I've been Stranky this has been the monthly update I hope you have a good month and before I go actually I just want to thank everyone um, we've got about six or seven new subscribers over the last two months welcome to the channel everybody thanks for hitting that button it really does mean a lot to me and i hope you enjoy your stay so thanks for watching and i'll see you all next month well apart from the videos in the meantime but yeah bye bye